I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos. We just finished this piano up today. It was a mega uh, last minute rush job um, for, a, for a family deadline for the, the person that, um, that wanted this and it turned out absolutely amazing. I had to coordinate lots of different people together, um, but it worked and we're delivering it tomorrow. We're gonna make the deadline. So uh, this is a totally unique custom job that, that I have never done before. I've never seen anything like this before. Um, and it turned out super, super cool. Okay, so let's get a, let's get a big shot of this piano. See if you can see if you can see what's unusual. If you're familiar with pianos, I'm sure it'll come, it'll jump right out at you. So of course, all of the hardware, that's sawdust, all of the hardware, is black um, plus they had us redo it in this dark dark black satin finish so so that was pretty cool uh, the, of course the pedals and the hinges the this hardware piece here this little hook that uh, does the lid these lid parts here so these are not painted they're powder coated which is a a super durable, if you're, if you're not aware of what powder coating is, it's like a super durable um, type of paint that is baked on. Um, it's not even the same league as, as like paint. Uh, it's, it's what most tools are, are, are coated with. Coating is probably a better word than paint. Um, yeah, it's just super tough. So, and then of course, so that so so we did this. They they bought it about I don't know six days ago. We did, we did the the finished job in um, in this satin block. We did that in three days. We had to super rush. And then this string cover here, this black string cover, that is a guy in in Florida that manufactures those. He usually takes about four weeks. And I requested that he that he do a super rush job, and he got it to us in like four days. And then of course the powder coater guy here in, in Linden, Utah, he got it done about that same amount of time. We got it all put back together and now this piano is just, just super cool, super interesting. And it's a Hyloom 151, um, which actually the piano that I have in my house, I've had it for about 10 years, is, is the next size up, the Hyloom um, 161. And, uh, and I asked them, about the logo. They said, yeah, I'll leave the logo. So the only thing that's, I guess, the only two things that are not black would be the logo and the white keys. And it's just, it's just an awesome piano. So, um, and actually, actually, the guy, the guy that we did this for, I'll mention this briefly. He's a uh, he's a, an, the owner of a local company, and one of the colors of, of his company is is black, um, and uh, and apparently he wears all black all the time. Um, he's just kind of a he loves black, black everything, and so this is super unique. And we mentioned the possibility about some sometime in the future doing doing the, the other color of his logo, which is a, a unique color. Um, and, and yeah, that'd totally be doable, doing a different piano, like we could refinish it that color and we could do all the hardware in black or, you know, the keys one color, leave, maybe the keys the color of the logo and the, the black keys, the, the leave them black. I don't know, lots of different, lots of different interesting possibilities that, uh, that we could do. So if that's, I mean, if, if that appeals to you, um, something something like this something creative uh, that's an option we can do it this particular application we've never done before but I'm really excited about it I think it I think this guy had really cool vision I think it turned out great so if you have um, an artistic bent like 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 this this guy does um, and you would like some sort of a custom custom job on the piano we can do it I mean, We've done all sorts of things, uh, crazy things. This is this is the first time we've done this particular one. Very cool.